Welcome back, Buffs, to the CUI Weekly. I'm James Bradbury, and this is what's been happening around CU lately. Renovation of the rec center is still in full swing. A lot of progress has been made over the summer. Both the men's and women's locker rooms have been completed, and currently, construction of the new ice rink is underway. Completion of the rec center is still proposed for late fall semester 2014. Kittredge Field will be home to CU's inaugural women's lacrosse team. New turf has been installed over the summer, and more additions are to come. The upgrades will be phased in over three to five years and will involve additional bleachers, locker rooms, and restrooms. On Sunday, York Colorado Buffaloes defeated in-state rival CSU 41-27, the 85th Rocky Mountain Showdown at Sports Authority Field at Mile High in Denver. Even though both teams had disappointing seasons last year, CU and CSU fans alike filled the stadium to support their school. With both a new head coach, Mike McIntyre, and new athletic director, Rick George, the Buffs are starting off their 2013 season well. Monday, it was announced that junior wide receiver Paul Richardson was named the Pac-12 Conference's Offensive Player of the Week. Richardson covered 208 yards with 10 receptions on Saturday and scored on plays of 82 and 75 yards. The Buffs are scheduled to play Central Arkansas this Saturday in the home opener. Also on Saturday, the women's volleyball team defeated St. Mary's of California 3-1 in Boulder. Their next game will be against Stony Brook in Syracuse, New York on Friday, September 6th. Also defeating St. Mary's was our women's soccer team, who won 2 to nothing. The women's soccer team is 5-0 and so far this season and have shut out all of their opponents. Their next match is this Friday versus Alabama at the Denver Invitational. Fall intramural registration opens Tuesday, September 3rd, and will continue until the 5th. To register for intramural sports, head to www.imleagues.com. After more than 20 years as Dean of the College of Music, Daniel Schur stepped down from his position. While the committee searches for a permanent dean, James Austin will serve as the interim dean for the 2013-2014 school year. The committee hopes to find a new dean before fall of 2014. Want to discover what it would be like to live and learn abroad? Visit the UMC Fountain this Thursday, September 5th to get information about the Study Abroad Fair. CU Study Abroad staff and alumni will be available to answer questions and help students begin the process of going abroad. All new international students are welcome to join the Boulder Friends of International Students at their fall welcome picnic on Sunday, September 8th at Martin Park. The picnic will go from 5 to 7 and free food is provided. From the CUI, I'm James Bradbury. Thank you for watching and have a good week.